everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Sarah from Basically Baker and today's video is the Baker Girls morning routine. I'm going to show you what a typical morning looks like in our house and it starts out with my husband making me coffee at around 6 a.m. That's when he wakes up for work and we've gotten in the sweet habit of him making me a cup of coffee and bringing it up to me in bed. I like to spend about 10 to 15 minutes enjoying my coffee and waking up slowly and doing some journaling or some work just so I can get my thoughts together and have a little time to myself before the craziness of the day. So right now he's making me coffee in one of my favorite mugs, my Ray Dunn mug, and he's going to bring it up to me for me to enjoy and start my day. seven o'clock the girls usually wake up every day I start by going in there and turning the light on then we change diapers put on our outfits for the day they like helping me pick out their outfits now that they're two they love saying the word outfit because they're super girly just like me and like picking out their clothes we do our hair and then head downstairs for milk and breakfast <music> If you have a toddler, you know that every meal of every day is different. Usually, I try to start them out with a big healthy breakfast first thing in the morning to jumpstart their day. Today's breakfast consisted of eggs and a waffle. However, they weren't really interested in either of that. You can see Josephine was eating pieces of her waffle, but Eloise was just playing around and pretending to eat, thinking I won't notice. And not actually eating so they ended up drinking their milk and having a third option of breakfast which was oatmeal that they were requesting so they ate their oatmeal and enjoyed that and had some bananas to go with it So now it's around 8.30 and it's finally time for me to eat breakfast. Today I am having overnight oats with strawberries on top and I'm going to insert a clip here of when I prepared it last night. Mm -hmm. 
breakfast because us moms can never just sit and enjoy our breakfast am I right I am also emptying the dishwasher and reloading it these are the dishes just from this morning we have a system that after dinner before bed Grant will load the dishwasher one final time and then one of us will unload it in the morning and that way it's ready to be loaded with the new dishes we say all the time we can't really believe that between just the four of us we go through these many dishes but somehow we do. So I spend this time doing dishes, eating my breakfast in between, and thinking about what I have to do next which usually involves prepping dinner for the evening or prepping lunches or something for the girls. In this case, today it's the beginning of the week and I will be making muffins for the girls. I had noticed that my, I call it dessert container that I like to display out on the counter was empty and whenever that's empty, I like to fill it just because I like how it looks and obviously we all love how it tastes. So I thought I should make some dessert and use up the bananas that were just about ripe. So I'm starting to prep for that. So I will be making banana muffins. I will be making one tray regular size muffins for adults and then a smaller size for the girls, which they can eat just like that. And you can see here I'm prepping all the ingredients first and then I'll be combining it in the bowl, mixing it together and putting them in the pre-greased muffin tins. I'll have the recipe for this in the description box below.
done, I'm going to put the two muffin trays into the oven at 350 degrees and I'm going to check them at around 18 minutes to see if they're done. I'm going to assume that the smaller muffins will be done at that time. I'm really just going to be checking on the larger muffins to make sure they are cooked all the way through. Now it's 11 o'clock and it's time for the girls to watch Sesame Street. They usually only watch one show or about 30 minutes of TV a day and it's for Sesame Street. The girls love it and they know that it's time to watch, well they call it Elmo. And this is usually when they have a snack. Today they're having blueberries and raspberries. Now it's been 18 minutes and the muffins are done. I checked and both the smaller muffins and the larger muffins are done. So if you make this at home, then 18 to 20 minutes should be good depending on the size and thickness of your muffins. And they smell delicious. I cannot wait to try one. <music> Now it's noon and that's lunchtime for the girls. As I'm preparing their lunch, they are having a pre-lunch snack of the muffins. They saw them sitting on the counter and requested them and it looks like they were a hit. I would like to thank you for watching today's video. If you'd like to see more videos like this or if you'd like to see a complete day in the life or a meal prep video to show what I ended up doing this afternoon which was meal prepping our lunches let me know in the comments box and I will see you in next week's video